Greetings, everyone, along with Eddie Olchek, Mike Emmerich. Looking forward to a high-scoring contest tonight. Well, at least maybe for one team, Doc, because one team certainly has the ability to fill the net as well as any team in the entire league. Penguins coaching staff has them playing a fast-paced, straight-ahead offensive brand of hockey. In order to play this way, you have to know what you are doing with the puck before you get it. Okay, so let's look at the starting goaltenders for the game. Marc-Andre Fleury gets the call to the goal crease half his life ago at age 15. He was playing major junior hockey for the Cape Breton Screaming Eagles, and he dreamed of making a save that would win his team a Stanley Cup. He did just that for Pittsburgh in a Game 7 10 years later. Johnson's the man at the other end of the ice for the Islanders. You notice the winning percentage? He said before the game he wants to be better and that the coach was right for choosing him tonight. Face-off about to start. John Tavares to be there for it, and why not? He's the Islanders' captain and all-rookie team member from his recent past. This is hockey in Pittsburgh just starting. Back in front. Wow, what a glove save. Oh, if you're a shooter, you don't want to see the goaltender flash his glove like that. Angled to Steen. Carries it toward the woodwork. Keeps it going back behind the net. Good poke check by Kulin. Back in his defensive end to get it. To Opozo. Oh, did he ever get mashed? This guy can play any way you want. And there, the physical side. Slides it to the point to Crosby. Takes that pass. Routine save. You're not going to beat him from there with that shot. The Islanders get two minutes up on the penalty clock for interference. Clearly an interference call not allowing the player to get involved into the play. The Penguins have a decided advantage on the power play between the two teams. Tonight it'll be really important to stay disciplined and stay out of the penalty box. Two minutes for interference. Time of the penalty. The Islanders shoot it back out. Got some time to check the clock and prepare to defend again. Takes that on his stick and looks ahead. In on the two-on-two. -two. Can they get reinforcements here? He takes that point pass. Take it away. Finally lifted back out so they can get some fresh troops out. To Dupre. On to Hornquist. He'd given a pass. Now he gets one. Oh, another save. Oh, he meant well, but it didn't go out off one of his own guys. Pittsburgh's back to play in their own end as the clock ticks down on the power play. Could not be filtered through a strong play by Hornquist. Moves up the wing. He's got it, but has to get rid of it. Sent on by Hammond. The Penguins go back to pick it up. Time is dwindling on this power play. Right along the blue line to Eliash. New York's done it. Back at full strength. That covers some acreage to Viznovsky. Wrist shot. Oh, stick save. Gains the zone. Defense to offense begun by Skilly. He can start some danger here. Sets up shot. Look out in front. Outstanding point blank save. You don't get many better opportunities than that. Great save. Two sticks together, they cancel. To the safety of the net while his team makes changes. To LaPierre. Let's go, Arister. Oh, a save there. Good defensive play. Possession changes. Parked in the slot, and it's on his stick. Great glove save. Why? What a chance. Everything's got to go through the middle of the ice. That's exactly where he was, but he missed the chance. Looks ahead to start something. Given back to Bolton. Takes it on the wing. Puck gathered in behind the net by Seidenberg. Taken right up the middle. Guided through center for Sutter. Chip to Downey. The Islanders shift from defense to offense. To Grabner. To Nielsen. Slid to Spalling. Offside stops the clock.
Fleury's able to bail his team out as they burp up a defensive zone turnover. A little under four minutes still to play in this period. Game still waiting for its first goal. Face-off win, and now what will they do with it? Good distance on that one to Hickey. That one dropped back into the opposite corner. Takes it behind his own cage. Oh, bad giveaway there. Save! Carried toward the woodwork by Sidney Crosby. Picks it up in his own end. Nearing the final minute of play. Puck fired down, decision made. Defenders first, icing. Defensive zone win. Decides on the area behind. In the first to Clutterbuck. Full steam up the wing. Propelled to Clutterbuck. The Penguins will start from their own end. Oh, here's a wrister. Great glove grab. 20 minutes have passed. They worked hard in that period. Don't know about you, but I've got a lot of ink left here. Few entries, no goals on that scorecard. Now for a look at the shots on goal in the first period. Five for the Islanders and four for the Penguins. Fleury's enormous save has kept his team in it. We have ended the period and he gets a rest. And so do we as we head to break. Underway here in the second period of a scoreless game. Laid on to Elias. Oh, what a glove he's got there. It's risky business here, especially when you've been there a lot. To Opozo. Opozo's on the limp after that big hit, Doc. He's working his way slowly to the bench. Through center. What a move at the net. Moves up along the boards. Oh, that's good. And he's hammered. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. Oh, he made him zig when he should have zagged, didn't he? Long lead pass to Kuhleman. To Nielsen. Gets in. What'll he do? Superb defensive play by Hornquist. Terrific save. Terrific opportunity. Not often you're all alone in front of the goaltender from this area of the ice. Great save. Wrist shot. He scores! to this high scoring area, a wrist shot is a great choice. Johnson's not gonna stop that one, Enzo. It's delivered so perfectly just inside the post. Just under six minutes have passed. Only one goal hanging on the board so far. So it's 1-0. New York's prevailed goal. again on the face-off of the neutral zone. It's an onside play. Two guys together with force. Big force. He wished him a happy birthday four months early. He's into the slot. And by number three. Pointed to Gleason. Led on to Dupre. Got his pad on that one. Heads along the boards. Perfect receipt of the pass. Score! And the game is even. The goaltender had no chance stopping that puck with the quick release. The passer recognizes that he's got to get the puck up in the air, but he displays sweet hands as it goes just over the stick and lands flat on the ice.
Pittsburgh's got that one. His fifth of the season. Takes a chance on the dump to the opposite corner. Martin, assisted to Clutterbuck. Ryan Strom, and by number 36, Eric Bolton. Time of the goal, eight minutes. Snatched up by Seidenberg. Takes it up near the boards. Taken to the corner by LaPierre. Wrist shot. Oh, he saw the window open, but he didn't even touch the curtain. Oh, he was trying to be too cute with that shot. You cannot miss the net that badly. Up the wing with it now. Taken over by Seidenberg. Back in his defensive end to get it. Long lead pass to Malkin. Shook through great. Cruises to the slot. Oh, he'll pay for that. Puck covered, whistle blown. Sometimes there's just nowhere to go with the puck. Guys, this is an excellent shot, but the goaltender makes an excellent pad save. Solid, clean win. To Erhoff. And played through center for Hornquist. Pass to the net. Wonderful. Oh, what a pad save. On to Bolton. To Martin. Up the wing. Long on two by Hammonick. Back behind while players change. Perfect pass. Picked up in the attacking zone. Freezes play. The shot's delivered quickly, but he smothers the bottom of the net so well, gets his legs out to make the stop. New York's got a defensive zone win. Last Into the last play. minute of the, second, the second period. period. Chip to Grabner. <laughs> Puck picked up in the neutral zone by Patrick Elias. <laughs> Gathered in by Grabner. And he pushes it on through mid-ice. Two periods down, one period to go. A little energy being built now. Fans, don't Check to out the shots on goal through these two periods. Poster, which will give away 11 for the, the Penguins team. and 7 for the Islanders. This game is tied, and because of this goal, it is tied. Intermission is coming up. A tie contest going into the third period. We're underway. Flip to the opposite corner. Looks ahead to start something. To Steen. Moves up the side with it now. Speared along by Hammond. Glides to the safety behind the net. To Kuhleman. Knocked right off the stick. Shook right through. Turned aside off the pad. To Opozo. In the slot, he's taking a perfect centering pass. What a hit. I saw it. Sticked away. Pass to the slot. Big pad save. Neutral zone carry. Jabbed away by Hammond. He's got that one. Let's see what happens. Grabbed off by Erhoff. It's on his stick. What a brilliant pass that was. Nice job. Straight stand-up poke check. 
and he is reefed. He's got that point pass. Forcing attention in deep. Pope checked away by Seidenberg. Glides to the safety behind the net. He's got him against the glass. Slid to Malkin. Geometrically to Hornquist. Hammers one. Got his stick on it. Driven up the wing by Downey. Strong play. Good reach. Pope checked away. Swept on to Skilly. Rister. Great glove save. A quick turnover. Wonderful work in close and a brilliant save. Score! That's two unanswered goals. A little under eight minutes to go in the third period. New York's lead is one, and it's a fresh lead. Propelled to Bortuzzo. Into the attacking end. He drives toward the slot. 12 minutes, 13 seconds. Receives that pass from the other side. The Islanders shift from defense to offense. Carries it up the wing. To Gleason. Moves it to the barrier at center ice. Turned right away with the poke check. Tay! Gets play stopped. They win it. Can he generate something? To Elias. Shot. Wonderful save. What skill by both goalie and shooter. Seems like he was in too tight on the goaltender. We go down to the benches. Here's Ray. Johnson's been under incredible pressure almost all night. There's been traffic right on top of his crease, yet he's had to battle through it, and he's been excellent in goal. Good face-off win. Terrific love save. Controlled through the middle. Picks it up in his own end. Laid on to Crosby. Wires one up the gut to Eliash. He got it in. He got his glove on that one. And he'll hold on. One of their best players, it doesn't matter how many chances that they've had against him. He's kept them in the lead because his play has been exceptional. Johnson's been the one key reason that his team's been able to hold on to this lead. He's faced a high percentage of top quality shots. He stopped virtually everything. Nielsen's carrying it through center. Pitched back into the offensive zone. That's not only a good play of getting the puck deep, but also having that awareness of knowing where you are in the game. Grabbed by Hammond. Nicely received at the point. He's superb. Save by Fleury. A quality chance, a better save. And he motors on through the neutral zone. And he's tied up and held. The Islanders will start from their own end. Right up the side. Cut by Spalding. Takes it up that side to Skilly. Skilly's playing with a lot of confidence in scoring. Great stick save. Picked up in the attacking zone. Score! It's tied. Not much time, but it's even. You want to score goals, you've got to get to this area of the ice. And so we can't get the blocker up quick enough. The hole up over his stick side shoulder is too big. The puck finds its way in.
Pittsburgh's got another faceoff win. Lets a shot fly. Blocked. This contest will need extra time. Here's a look at the shots on goal through 60 minutes in our game still undecided. 18 for the Penguins and 15 for the Islanders. Spalling's goal takes us to overtime. That's where we'll be when we come back. have begun sudden death overtime. Nobody scores. Somebody will in a shootout. Good work stepped on by. Scooped up by Airhoff. Diagonally to Crosby. Look at this. He heads right for the net. Score! The overtime winner. And the players spill over the boards to celebrate. Game over. Penguins have taken this one in sudden death. Got back into the game late and eventually win it in OT. So that is it for this one. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. For Eddie and Ray, Doc saying good night all.